Mom, Daddy, can I go to school? Um, why would you want to come to school when it's summer break? Because I'm feeling a little bit bored and I kinda want to do some work but there's nothing much really around here I could do for some exercise. Oh, um, okay, we were going to do some fireworks later anyway, but I don't see why not. Yeah, she's been home a lot lately. How about we let her out the house for a little bit so she doesn't get bored? Yeah, no need to worry. You'll just sit back and relax while I'm at school working. Oh, okay. Thanks, daughter. Let's go, y'all. Yay, 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 yay. You parents are the best parents in the world. And you're the best daughter. Oh, hey, Gina. How's your summer going? Good, Principal Clementine. Our daughter was getting a little bored so we thought if she could be with you guys and participate in any of you guys' summer school work or activities. Well, the summer schoolers are doing nothing but eternity amount of work, but I can have help from uncertain favorite little angel of mine helping me out around including students. Well Gina, are you up for it? Yes ma'am. Okay, we will pick you up later, have fun sweetheart. Okay, Gina, come over here. I have a job for you to do. Man, I can't stand another day of summer school doing an eternity amount of work. We done an eternity of English work yesterday and we're doing math, which is even worse than English. I'm just hoping Principal Clementine doesn't come in here and give our paperwork. I just want to die already from all of this. Please do not open the door. I beg for you. Please, do. Not. Open. The. Door. You're going to jinx it if you say that. Okay. No one say anything or think for mercy and don't hope for her to come into the classroom so we can have bad luck of her coming in. I doubt that's going to even work Dory along you can't trust the internet these days. Or everyone could just act casual. That's it. I'm running for my life. Um, hey. Um, what was that? Gina, what the heck are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be home? No, I wanted to come to school because I'd rather do work and study all devices all day like a rounded student and show you to be more like me when it comes to doing your work. Oh, so you're still going to continue being bratty, huh? Well, I'm not tolerating this until August, plus I don't think Principal Clementine would want you in school right now. Well, actually, Principal Clementine let me be in the school and made me as her helper for the day and that means I can teach me a lesson for always being a jerk to me. Also for shoving a beer bottle down my throat, and put alcohol in the soup. Which means you'll have to do whatever I say or I'll tell Principal Clementine, so you better be good. Oh my freaking god Gina I can't believe you're doing this to me and you could have just stayed home and mind your freaking business about this and my day would have been less of a living heck. First I have to come to school on 4th of July and do an extremely annoying amount of work and now we have to put up with your little ass voice and your million times worse than that principal pathetic piece of crap. Why on earth don't idiots stop looking at you from the outside and see the inside of how much of a braggy scumbag smith you are? What's going on? And where's Caillou? Caillou jumped out of the window. This piece of crap thinks she can just come in here and act like a teacher to us, and I most certainly know you didn't tell her to come here. Have fun getting grounded for once, Jenna. I told her to come in here and be the teacher you idiot. What? How is this even okay? I'm okay with it because after all of the bad things you done like get Gina in trouble, get drunk and made disturbance to everyone, tie us up, and finally made everyone drunk to soup. That was all in the past like does that matter? Yes. You stay out of this you piece of crap. I bet you're not talking to me like that. I was talking about Jenna. I think she was talking about you. And there you go trying to get me in trouble again, you piece of shit. Look, I'm gonna give this one warning, Dora. If any of you give Gina a hard time or continue to yell at her, I'm calling your parents right away. Understand? Yes, Principal Lementine. And that's a referral. I'm going to get you those work. Crap. Crap. Can't just take it, it, it any worse? Like, like, come on, come it's 4th of, of July. July. Welcome back, K.I.U. Thanks. Later. Are you done yet? Why don't you mind your freaking business, you freaking idiot? We're already in enough trouble all because of you. Now freak off. Jesus, I'm tired of always being so rude to me. Do you know that somehow I'm gonna get at her back and stand up for myself? 
I know. I'm going to give her and her friend the light and I'm going to treat him as his earning the work. <laughs> Alright you guys, you can't take a break and we're gonna do something else. Thank goodness. We're not doing any more work. What? Are you sure? Yeah. Positive that she really wants us to burn our papers? Yes, now burn it when telling the teacher. It seems pretty quiet. Maybe Gina finally got into their hard-headed... Where is that fire going on at? It's happening in 303, which is the same room as... What in the name of what the heck is going on here and why is there a fire? They refuse to do their work and decide to bring their work. What? That's a lie, you piece of crap. Yeah, Gina's lying. She tricked us into burning our papers and forced us to do it. Yeah, don't believe that goody for nothing piece of garbage. Oh my, no. Just no. I'm calling your parents. Wait, hang on, stop, you don't want to do this. Listen, I've been a good boy, I've been a good boy, please. I've been such a good boy, don't do it. Oh, wait. Hello. Hello, Boris. This is Principal Clementine speaking. And I want to tell you your son and along with his friends burned a whole pile of their paperwork. What? I had a feeling this would happen at some point to get out of doing their work after they made voodoo dolls out of us and torture us with them. I'm coming right now. You piece of crap stay in here for two weeks and don't even think about escaping or I will hunt you down and you will have punishment day. You guys are most certainly not going to do any fireworks with us tonight. This is all Gina's fault that we're in this mess. I know, I always had to deal with her annoying bragging all the freaking time, like why did she have to come to school? I don't know, but if her annoying stupid self just stayed home on summer break, like, a, normal, freaking, person and not get us in trouble like this, then none of this would have happened. Also your dad needs to stop acting like a father figure to us and punishing or taking us wherever without permission. I'm not worried about my dad, I'm just tired of my annoying sister like this morning when I accidentally spilled juice on my dad's clean car, Rosie told my dad and then I got grounded. The same situation happened to me too but different last night with my piece of crap sister. Well, there's one thing left to do. What? Huh? One little one little one will be getting a punishment day. That's a great idea. We could have done the same for our parents before. Well, I mean you guys' parents, because in the past I gave my dad a punishment day once. Great. Let's do it. But how are we going to escape if we're gonna get a punishment day if we do by your dad? Uh, who cares? Brad isn't going to have two punishment days in one video anyway. Rest in peace the fourth wall. Alright. You guys run as fast as you can out of here while I get Rosie real quick. Doris, I sworn I seen two of those brats run past us. Oh, I'm sure it's just your imagination again, Boris. I'm telling you, I saw two of them ran past us. I think you just need to relax like there's no way they are going to escape if they want to meet Punishment Day. Meanwhile... Okay, why did you bring all of us here for? And why are we at a baseball court? Well girly pieces of crap, the reason why we bring you here is, we're tired of your crap, since you ruined our 4th of July, we're gonna ruin yours by, giving, you, a, punishment, day. Arthur, I didn't ruin your 4th of July. You were literally trying to feed Sabo cocaine. <laughs> I don't freaking care and you're still getting a punishment day no matter you like it or not. No, 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 no. You know, hearing my own voice suffering from another character gives me chills. Tell me about it. So first punishment, beating you up with our bats. <laughs> Second punishment, taking a boiling hot shower. Ouch, 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 oh my god, the freaking bird is so bad, right? Third punishment, drinking expired milk that was from 2004. How the heck is that even possible? Just drink it now, or there will be additional punishments. <laughs> Three.
Fourth punishment, watching grounded videos of yourselves. No, 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 no. I can't stand to see myself get grounded. Please, can't we skip this punishment? No way, you piece of crap. You being annoying, braggy, spoiled, and the most part I hate, a snitch. It's about time you got taken down. Now, come on, press, play. One hour later. <laughs> Holy crap Jenna, I can't believe you would kill Caillou's mom and beat Caillou up and get arrested for it, you've been a very bad 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 troublemaker ha 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 No 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 that's not me swimming down the water Alright, fifth punishment, making an embarrassing video out of y'all No 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 please don't do that to us Oh, we're not making the video You are What? No Rose is awesome. Not piece of crap. Well, too bad. Rose is piece of crap anyway. Now make that embarrassing video of yourselves or there will be 100 more additional punishments. Okay, fine. Wha- uh, uh. Two hours later. Sixth punishment is going into the closet. Um, okay. And suffer firecrackers. What? Seventh punishment burning all of your favorite things in the incinerator. No, 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 no. Uh, Thank goodness they didn't take any of my things. Now this blue baby is next. Sabo. No. Uh, uh. Eighth punishment, shooting fireworks at you, now, shoot. Uh, uh, stop, make it stop. Ninth punishment, pepper spraying your eyes. Please tell me this is over. Oh, we got one more punishment left, and it's going to take you on a long never-ending trip. What do you mean? Well, get in the box that is behind you. You know what? I'm just going to do your stupid final punishment to get over with and also the people who find out you give us a punishment day and drown you for it. Yeah, me too. And me. Well, that was easy. Let's do this. Yes, they're gone. No more little enemies especially that good for nothing Gina. Oh, so you thought you would get away with this? Um, Dad, what are you doing here? I thought you and Mom were gone on a three hour trip and back here at night. That's true. But did you really think we would leave you at school while your sister was at home? You know we can't trust you when it comes to you having your sister under your care, so this whole time we've been in the garage looking at the security camera and I was right, and I already told you, Caillou and Dora parents about it already. Anyway, did you seriously gave those three a punishment day? Did you? Why the heck are you asking if you already saw us did it? sister not just that but those other two a punishment day. I still can't freaking believe you did this and you're going to get so punished for it. Dora! How freaking dare you! Oh no 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 Why do you like to watch your own dream? It's so much you say that that show isn't your whole life is at all for you. You are going to be in deep 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 trouble. Can you? I don't want you to get to Rosie. You piece of crap was sitting
chose to say in the room, but no, you decided to meet death. You are so freaking screwed in your three are grounded, 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 nine eight four seven nine six four nine eight seven four two eight seven six five four five six four five five four seven four two eternities. Alright, now to finish this off. I'm sending you troublemakers on a long trip and don't come back. Like that's going to happen. Huh, a black hole. Does that mean? Oh. At last, peace and quiet.